There we go. There's the sun. Maybe. There's the sun. Kara's driving. Because my car has 30 kilometers in gas left. But I'll change it before we go. I filled this two days ago, and when I was on my way here, I had 130, and I'm at 90. What the heck? Yeah, I don't know. Also, I went from literally like a quarter tank to an eighth in the time. How that weird! I, came to get you. I don't know what that means. I have good gas. No. Yeah, me too. It's okay. You're driving to the house, right? Yes, ma'am. And we're good. I don't have to worry about it until later. Can we just have a conversation really quick about buildings that change names? Oh yeah. Cause so we live in Toronto, kind of. So everything downtown like changes names, like the ACC, the Rogers Center, the Scotiabank Arena. What else? Just, like, just down. Um, How do you need it? Thank you. <laughs> um, so they keep like changing everything. I I, I understand because it's like that company bought it. But like you made a really good point the other day that they should just name it something generic. <laughs> yeah. And then like each company that buys it, like whatever, they can like put their logo it. on it or something. They don't need to change the whole name of it. Yeah. So we live like right near the um, where the Leafs and the Marlies practice. It's their practice arena, I think, or their skating rink. Is it called an arena? No, a rink. Whatever. Um, <laughs> I actually have no idea. And it used to be called the MasterCard Center, and then the other day we were driving, and now it's called Ford. Yeah. Ford Center, maybe. Yeah, so. Like what the hell? Yeah. <sighs> like people who don't visit the city often would be like. I know I'm at 90 or 100. <laughs> oh my God, were we on a hill? Uh, no, not when we checked it the last <laughs> time. The car is possessed. It's better than <laughs> the <laughs> other one. Tell them the other story. The that other was car. <laughs> we had to disable the like trunk button because <laughs> the trunk would randomly pop open. Uh, what else didn't work on that? The there music was music that would come on. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes like a random like old woman station would come on because the <laughs> woman. I'm pretty convinced it was like an old woman that lived in the car before. Like it was, and then she like died suddenly. So I was really convinced that she was just haunting it. And then like <laughs> near the end of its lifetime, the speedometer didn't work. The gas thing didn't work. And like the speedometer would literally just like read zero, like regardless. And then. But it was like cold, so we just thought it was because it was getting cold, but then it yeah. was getting warmer, and then it worked, but like, you would go through those like traffic zones where it's like monitored, and it would say you were going like 40, but it would be like 55 on like the actual reader. <laughs> so like the speedometer never worked, and yeah, it was just like a great car all around. And then every time um, you like started it from like stopping, it would like, um, I don't know how to explain it, it would like, not crap out, but like you could tell that like it was like really trying to go. Like it would do that like do 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 thing. Oh. That it was like what the hell, and then yeah, turning the corners was a mess. And, yeah, turning the corners was. A mess. It was better, but it's better than my dad's old car that we still have in the driveway. Like the battery just like crapped out and it died, so it's just been kind of in the driveway. And like it'll like it hasn't been used in forever, and it'll randomly just like the horn will start going off sometimes. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> so. So this one is way better. Yeah. Despite the fact that it doesn't know how much gas you have left. 104. <laughs> Anyways, we're at the gym. the gym now. I might get a clip or two, but we'll see. <laughs> I love when she cleans. What are you doing? I'm cleaning. You're cleaning? Uh -huh. You're doing a good job. See? Wow. Mm. You did so good. Uh -huh. All done? Uh -huh. Thanks. nice out before and <laughs> okay my hair looks a little crazy because I had like 10 minutes to do it so it's just like really weird looking curls and I put the top part up and then I have on like tinted moisturizer and a little bit of highlighter and that's all my outfit this shirt is from American Eagle uh, Kara got it for me for Christmas, and then, excuse all the stuff on my floor, these are American Eagle jeans. Let's go. We're 
we're literally in the world's longest drive through line. I'm sorry, I was picking up my nose ring. <laughs> Ditto. We've been in this line for... We've been... No, eight minutes? That's not real. That can't be right. That's what I thought it was. I don't know. We've been in this line for a while. Yeah. As I look up my nose. What are you getting your nails? How are you getting your nails done? Tell the world. Um, they're gonna be like the French color. Like you see oh, this? Show them. I don't think they've seen these ones. Ooh, so cute. So cute. So cute. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Um, this is like the French color right here. Obviously, like that has black lines, but it's like kind of clear. And I'm just gonna get them all this color. And I don't think I'm gonna get them shortened, except for like my pinkies, because I feel like these are like really long. But I'm gonna leave the last one this length. Yeah. yeah. And, and mine are this. And I'm just gonna get plain pink and I'm gonna change the, the shape of them because we'll see how I like those better. Yeah. That's all. You're keeping the same shape? I was gonna say coffin, but they're not all coffin. No. I think when I get my nails done next time I'm gonna get them all stiletto, but like kind of like I'm kind of I used to ha I used to always get them stiletto in high school. Mm -hmm. And then I did coffin and like out of high school. Changing my life. Anyways, let's but go yeah. before the Starbucks guy laughs at us. Oh my god! Okay, hello. We're back three hours later. <laughs> I'm kidding. I hope it wasn't that long. No. Oh. An hour, almost an hour and a half. Okay. Whatever. To be fair, it only took them like an hour. But we had to wait because uh, we always have to wait even once we have a fucking hour. It's okay. They're thinner than Angelina's. <laughs> I just want to say something to the world right now. Yeah? If I ever get married, I need my husband to come with me to the nail salon. Yeah. Because that was quite possibly the cutest thing that I've ever seen in my entire life. Was it? He was like so down for it though. Like I feel like he might have asked if they could go. I kind of love that. He was getting a sports manicure. I don't even know what that is. What the fuck is a sports manicure? Yeah, so he got a sports manicure and a pedicure. And this man was like living his best life. We were I was sitting beside his girlfriend and we were laughing because she was like, she just kept looking over at him and he's like full he's on. He's like full on napping. Like, his eyes were closed, he had a woman doing his hand, a woman doing his foot, and he was like, living his best life. Anyways, these are my nails. These are mine. They're the same color, but they're different shapes, obviously. Yeah. I actually really love this these shape. They're so long. <laughs> like, I didn't get them shortened, I only got the pinky shortened. Um, But like, it's like different when you actually see like with the growth versus mm -hmm. like them actually here. So like, they're super long, but I love them. But they're long, but they're not like obnoxious, cause they're like- No, like they're like, and I don't think I would ever get them any longer than this. I'm literally obsessed with this color though. This is the one that I had the last time I had nails, like before I went off. Where am I going? Uh, Did I miss the turn again? Left. No, okay. I'm a little thought. Um, okay. The last time I had nails before I took them off, it was this color and I'm like obsessed. Like this is everything to me. Yours are about as thick as mine actually. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I really like this like clary color. It's just like the French. Yeah, it's um, like just very. Top coat or whatever it is. I don't really know. It's very like basic, but it's like better than just like having a nude. I feel because it's sort of like it's something. Yeah. Oh, it reminds me of that like soft powder. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really like them. Mm -hmm. So cute. My hand hurts so bad though. I like scuffed it at the gym, and then when she put the hot towel, I was like, Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Where am I going? Left, right? Uh, right. Lush Cosmetics Laboratory. Yeah, weird, right? Squeeze me. Who knew? Okay, side down. I think it's kind of weird when they write on like the Lush products, like who made it. Yeah. Can you imagine working for for Lush and like having your name on things? It's not their name that freaks me out. It's the photos of them. Yeah. It's like that's a lot. There used to this building used to be. I mean, it's still a meat house or whatever, like a butcher. Uh huh. But it used to be like I think it was called European Deli or something. I don't know, but they used to have the best. Um, There's a lot of cops out today. There are. Is it illegal to vlog and drive? Not if I'm, I'm not holding it, so I don't think so. No, it's just sitting on the dash, and plus I could be vlogging. It is so warm in here. Um, that's, there's like actually a lot of cops, like that's the third cop I've seen today. Oh, and usually I see zero. Actually yeah. I saw one the other day, like driving around in like my like, like not the main streets, like the little side roads, which kind of weirded me out, because like they're usually just on the main roads, like yeah, yeah, yeah. we live in like, we live in a suburb. Yeah, so like you don't typically see like you literally live on a cul-de-sac. Like there was no reason for him to be in that area. Yeah, so it's yeah like the especially the area I live in, it's like a lot of cul-de-sac. So it's like kind of like weird to see them there because like yeah, that is a weird place. Yeah, there's just like no. 
I um Real. was picking Kaylee up from school the other day, and she lit or she doesn't live. She lives with me. So. It's kind of ombre, but it's just the yeah, thing. yeah. It's, it's just the way like, that it goes. Yeah, yeah. But oh. she wanted to do a third coat, and I was like, no, I want it to still look like I have. Yeah, she asked me if that was. Like, no. I was like, no, it's good. Stop it. Anyways, um, Kaylee's school is like at the end of a road, and it's like surrounded by school or not uh, surrounded by um houses everywhere. So there's like no reason for there to be like cops really. Like same thing with her, but. There was a um, a pair of mounted police officer, like with the horses. The hell? I know, like walk, driving, or riding, riding past Kaylee's school. Interesting. At pickup time, it was so weird, but all the kids were like, horsey. Yeah. <laughs> what are you? Cowboy. What does a cowboy say? <laughs> you were just saying it. What does a cowboy say? Um. Yeah. Yeehaw. You got two robots and their friends? Uh huh. Oh, what color are they? Um, baby. Wow, who are they? Who's this guy? Um, robot, beep boop. Iron Man. Beep boop, beep boop. Fireman. Hey. Hey, you. Two fifty for the $40. That's $40. Cool. So $50 is his. Tails. Where are we? Um, joy. Store. Uh -huh. What are we getting? Um, the eggs. Yeah, there's eggs. Of course, she falls asleep right before we go to take our pictures. <laughs> so, okay. So I got myself ready, kind of, and she is ready for sure. And I got a bag of stuff, like props and stuff. I couldn't find. We have bunny ears, and I could not find them for the life of me, of course. So, no bunny ears, but that's fine. We're gonna go to a park near our house, kind of. And, um, actually, maybe I should go to the one further away, because then that one has, like, way better scenery. Look, Mommy, look. What? They're coming high above. Oh, they are. And you got a boy. Anyways, um, let's see if these pictures go well. a success but now I'm tired. Kel's gonna eat something. Watch some trolls while I edit the pictures. Say hi. Say hi. hi. Life with the three-year-old. Can you just eat your snack on the couch like a normal child? Are you normal? Are you? I don't know about that. 